the collection is just very subtle. It's very delicate. Very, uh, it's a matter of uh, tenderness. It's not aggressive at all, and it's very transparent, like uh, going to church with uh, not babies, but little girls playing to be uh, Madame and uh, Couture Clad. And for colors, what, what are we looking for this year? Is the palette softer or more darker colors? For the first time since a long, long time, it's not uh, all white, but it's off-white and a lot of uh, beige or very subdued and a lot of uh, pastel, but mainly uh, fake white, let's say. I think that Mr. Saint Laurent will never quit. It's not a departure for me because he is uh, in our mind forever. I just feel a little bit sad because it's like a funeral. So he is still alive and still creative. And a little bit sad too because uh, it's like if, uh, it, of course, he is timeless, but uh, this image of a stiff, classic, academic. Uh, suit for me is not enough. Mr. Saint Laurent is much, much, much more because it was so inspiring and is still so inspiring if we look at its work back with a Russian ballet and everything it did. And uh, I think, um, of course, but he, he, I think he was suffering a lot. He said on French TV two days ago that the pressure of uh, the um, stress of creativity was so strong that it was now unbearable physically. And they can understand it. And, uh